Hello traders it's Samurai Trader here welcome to this video so the purpose of the video today is to give you an update on some of the latest powerpoints and trading resources uh, that I've either had created or some of our members have created we've got uh, now close to 10,000 members globally and some of our members are very very active day traders some are newer traders mastering the art of day trading and some of these members have been kind enough to share in great detail how they trade my strategies they've created powerpoints so uh, some of them have sort of have changed some of the strategies slightly uh, to suit their personalities but I thought it'd be really good to show you where these resources are so I'm going to be recording these videos now on a regular basis because at the moment I pretty much just upload them regularly to the Google Drive and as you know the Google Drive yes it may be a gold mine but it can take a lot of sorting through so I'm going to update uh, with these regular videos now so just sort of go through some of the key videos now we might have to do it over two videos because some things I do need to explain so I'll do uh, session one today and we'll just uh, see how we go all right I do need to mention there is a risk in trading of course if you're watching a recording traders you can pause the recording to read the disclaimer bottom line is you don't trade with money that you can't afford to lose stay on the simulator until you're consistently profitable now you will find all of the updates I'm going to be referring to or just about all of them a couple of them you will find in the ninja trader uh, 8 indicator folder uh, but if you go to log into the members area latest updates and it's stated the 12th of the 6 2023 so what you'll find in there traders is a whole lot of things there okay so as I mentioned we won't get through them all we've got I think nine different powerpoints not that I want to go through all of the powerpoints anyway but and I'm not going to go through them all here but you'll find a lot of resources in that folder so um, uh, log into the general members area latest updates and you'll find them there now a couple of important things I want to bring up that have um, some of the latest things I've been doing so number one is in the coaching sessions I've been running through of members uh, a whole range of charts so usually each week I will bring up two or three new charts that I call that I label okay mark them up and we'll discuss them in the coaching session besides the live trading and besides going through everything else that we do in the sessions so I've uploaded this now in this uh, folder let me just close that for a moment I don't know how many there must be a hundred hundred odd uh, what I call labeled and marked up charts okay so some of them will not perhaps make sense if you just go and read them if you haven't attended coaching but some it will okay and we'll talk about the MACD BB uh, in a few minutes okay so uh, I've uploaded that there's about a hundred slides in there now what I'm going to be doing as I mentioned is adding as I do now in the coaching sessions we I add new um, uh, slides each week and we discuss them but we're also opening up uh, at the suggestion of some uh, members in our live trading room we're opening up or well, I'm opening up a folder on the Google Drive and I'm not quite sure what we're going to call it yet but it's for uh, members uh, to submit their winning trades and also their losing trades and to label on the charts the good stuff the bad stuff the ugly stuff so then um, we can share with other members and I'll give of course commentary uh, on those different slides and uh, different setups that are submitted so that's something that will be launched within the next uh, week as well but in this PowerPoint I won't in this video I'll actually do another video um, the coaching members and live trading room members have got access to this but just where I run through exactly what I'm looking for when I'm, when I'm uh, trading and also running the live room so first of all there is that folder the next one is from Raymond now Raymond is a member that we've had uh, gee, a number of years now a very valued member of our team a great contributor and uh, let me just have a look at a couple of things that Raymond has put in 
first of all uh, we've got here no no trade zones and this ties in to a power point that you'll see in a moment by April another one of our valued members so April uh, has even got her kids into trading now using our strategies and so one of the children actually come up with the ice cream sandwich and that is the flat 89 and 200 so the real uh, no trade zone so there's that document now he's got a lot of different things he's put together thinking like a trader a summary of a, a great book trading as a business um, by Dick Diamond and you hear us talk all the time about 80 20 trading we got that term really from Dick Diamond uh, he also created this particular Excel spreadsheet let me pull it up for you because many of you have not would not have seen this one so how to turn six hundred and fifty dollars into two hundred and forty thousand dollar income and so uh, he runs through and down here under the instructions and the pathway and of course implementing my setups uh, he explains how to do this now when you then you then go and tie that into another PowerPoint he put together not PowerPoint another spreadsheet he put together for me uh, just on the account size required and so both of these are in that folder now of course you should as members already have access to all of the spreadsheet such as uh, this one here our compound calculator uh, our process not income where is it here focusing on the process which we'll talk about in a moment actually uh, how to hit our daily targets etc so Raymond uh, was has been involved I didn't do this one but he did prepare the other one so uh, we can see down here that if you're going to start off on a micro so with the eight tick you need around seven hundred dollars in your account in fact in today's folder I've also got where is it here what if you then went for fifty dollars a day on a seven hundred dollar account that is trading the micro NQ trading the eight tick uh, many of you have not seen this one here so we, you need basically four seven step trades a day and you are there and basically on that basis you got the potential fifty dollars a day hitting your account size of ten thousand a week in only 13 weeks that's on that's on fifty dollars a day now just remember though the eight tick uh, can be too fast some of the time and that is where let me see if I've got the other one there mm, maybe not I've got another one there that um, I'll upload for you and actually let me just quickly find it for you now whoops not that one let me go back to this folder here and let me just uh, yes let me just quickly do this for you so this is on the uh, where is it here fifty dollars a day on the 12 tick so I'll quickly uh, upload this one as well so this is where uh, trading the 12 tick you'll need an account size of around a thousand dollars and that's ensuring that you never ever risk any more than two percent per trade of your account size and within 18 weeks now what a rate of return 10 grand a week within 18 weeks and look at the size of your account by then it's uh, nearly fifty thousand dollars and so um, it's important that you learn how to use these but also it's important that you set yourself some goals now fifty dollars a day on the 12 tick is realistic if you're going to trade two to three hours a day and look at the uh, return and remember here just as a quick reminder that where it says down here like you're trading a hundred micros in fact once your account size got to ten thousand dollars you'd flip over and start trading a standard lot so you wouldn't actually uh, um, uh, be trading 100 micros at that stage I'll leave that open just as a quick uh, reminder an actual fact I may as well just uh, cover this uh, sheet here why I'm uh, at it as well so this is a uh, a new upload I've got and I go through this with my one-on-one -on -one clients is and and of course in the live trading room as well I've got to be careful what I say here everyone gets access to it um, is to not focus on the dollars but to focus on the process of a number of ticks per day 
for an example if you're going to trade the YM or say the the, the Russell 2000 the artsy Y that's five dollars a tick um, what you really want to be making there is 20 net ticks a day and let me just quickly show you this and I think this is important so if you're going to trade the Russell or the RTY you need an account size of two and a half thousand dollars why well your maximum stop loss if you're waiting for your anchor chart one candle to close will be fifty dollars okay what's two percent of two and a half thousand it's fifty dollars now to net 100 a day on a two and a half thousand dollar account we can see we have the potential of hitting 10 grand a week income within 19 weeks and remembering traders you're only starting to trade another contract when you double your money and that's the thing um, it actually reminds me I was um, reading last week and many of you know I'm a fan of Larry Williams and um, uh, reading last week uh, an article that uh, he said uh, he, he wishes he got a dollar um, for every time somebody asked him how he turned ten thousand dollars into 1.1 million within one year in fact he actually hit about 1.9 million but he gave a lot of that back but one of the number one reasons was money management and the way he managed and compounded the funds now what we can see here with sensible money management look where you can be in a year's time you can do exactly the same thing never risking or any more than 2% and going for only 20 net ticks a day so that is the reality of this market the fact is most traders won't follow the rules now uh, one of the things of course many traders suffer from is fear not only fear of missing out FOMO but when it comes to trading and being focused on the on the wrong things so what I've had created um, for members is which I'm now sharing with you this one will go up to 40 okay 40 ticks now of course if you're trading say the NQ it's a little different there okay uh, or maybe a little different for you but or, or trading a micro but here if you're on say the ES or really oil or but oh no, you can even do it on them on the NQ of course but here you want to set a target to say 20 ticks a day now 30 ticks a day which is $150 if you go and then look at how many trades we really need to take for that it's not that many when it, and the tick value when you're trading two B's okay so if you're trading uh, two B's and let me just quickly show you this here for a moment uh, and so 150 a day okay you're there within what um, you're there within uh, 12 weeks 10 uh, 11 or 12 weeks you've hit whatever your target may be okay and here once again uh, uh, this is on the big contract by the way so here you are trading the big contract in this particular example now of course with the um, uh, with the Russell with the uh, YM uh, with uh, ES even with see how many of these markets now uh, they also have the micro so you can start off on a micro contract great great spot to start and actually uh, build from there but what I'm driving home here is uh, number one you've got to have a goal a realistic goal as well but here are some of the cheat sheets that I've got for you um, or can I really suppose I really shouldn't shouldn't call it a cheat sheet let me just open up a little folder here okay and just show you this so I've got had one done for you of 1 to 30 ticks okay so here if your target there is 30 that's $150 a day on the YM say if you're trading um, the uh, CL that's $300 a day it's $10 a tick and what you actually do here is uh, one way of uh, is that you're marking net tick so if you're trading say just let me use an example of the NQ or uh, uh, YM or the uh, RTY it's five dollars a tick so if you just had a 10 tick trade right you take off one 10 net ticks take off one for commissions and so now you're up nine ticks okay just allow one to cover your commissions but of course these are in words so you can tailor these and mark them yourself so running net ticks for there goes the date 
the markets and the time frames than any comments now some of you like to use spreadsheets but I find as a day trader things move too quickly and I just really don't have the time uh, personally to be and I'm look as my daughter always says dad you've got to get with technology but you know what I still love to handwrite so you can use these now I've also got this one uh, let me just show you this one which I've used for years uh, which is this here so all I simply do is put down the time I like to know which uh, what time how many trades for the day the trade type the result my run total how I'm ending up for the day and any comments so I still use that one you may prefer to use that one and still use that as as tick so all three of those I've uploaded into uh, I might just close that for now into um, uh, that particular folder as well let me just close that okay so and there, there's a couple of other things that Raymond's provide over time now the next one is from France France uh, 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 a, a new trader a new member he went to a lot of detail um, and put together uh, he was a member of my, my live trading room for a year uh, put together a great um, PowerPoint here just on the patterns that I trade um, and I've got some emails there and, and details on these and as he says I think down the bottom here of this basically did he actually say it here maybe it was in the email but basically you know you can hit your target within your first couple of hours uh, that apologies it's his English isn't first language two B's um, uh, so he said usually might have been in the email he's hit his target within uh, a couple of hours there so uh, his trading style a description of how he's trading my setups and so what I'm finding a lot of traders will say you know what I prefer this color I prefer that or here's what I've noticed uh, I actually say to um, other traders like I said to April because April's uh, three sons are getting into trading I said oh, it's like having my own little research team uh, putting stuff together so anyway that's been uploaded uh, now the next one here is is by April now April is put together where are we here a number of uh, PowerPoints now and in fact I haven't got uh, who latest is not there let me just quickly see where is that just quickly see there so that's another one I'll need to upload uh, let me just open this I have uploaded it um, but April calls this the magic money machine <laughs> seriously so April and her boys put this together um, uh, using my strategies um, I introduced the MACD BB uh, to the members some time ago and so April has actually got rid of a couple of other indicators and really focused on the MACD so as you can see it's just you know there's 70 odd slides there April's produced three or four different uh, slideshows now and a workspace here and I'll show you what it looks like on the screen I'll go to the charts shortly as well but um, I just put together so much information here uh, now there's a couple of important things I have uploaded into the folder that I recorded some time ago because it relates to a couple of PowerPoints here and what what um, April does for an example how to overlay uh, a higher time frame on a chart so we'll get to that in a moment so there is a video uh, that I produced and also just the settings use on ninja trader but the main thing is a link to a video you will find in that folder okay it'll show you how to upload now uh, how, how to actually overlay we call it a higher time frame so what you've got here is your lower time frame and you've then got your higher time frame on the one chart okay so um, uh, very very powerful so just in case you're unaware how to do that I've put that into the folder as well now what is also there is a couple of uh, easy trade entries and ah uh, that reminds me so <laughs> this is another thing uh, so with April and even uh, the Hulk Dave one of our long-term members uh, they've fallen in love with hard charts 
now hard charts you won't find anywhere they're pretty uh, uh, if you google hard charts I, I can't even remember how I came up with the name but it's a cross between Heikinashi and Renko charts maybe it was on the internet I can't remember but anyway we've also got hard charts which they prefer so you've got double smoothing effect when you're using both Renko and Heikinashi now for members that are not sure how to set up their heart charts what I've done is also have where is it there gee I hope I uploaded yeah um, it's time frames uh, maybe I didn't I, that's right I only included the video link so there's a video link in that folder of how to actually create a heart chart how you overlay okay and I think I got it there for trade station and it's it's pretty straightforward now I have to say this that if you go to a trading platform like think or swim and some of the others you're restricted with some of the flexibility that you might have say with trade station with ninja trader um, Sierra charts have got more flexibility so just remember that um, uh, some of the brokers that put out a trading platforms they don't put out as a sophisticated platform as many real day traders want okay so that's why ninja trader really and, and trade station would be probably no doubt the top two uh, and, and by the way this is not a promise okay for those that are saying hang on Ray you haven't mentioned this platform look there's a lot of great platforms out but bottom line is ninja trader um, particular it's got so much flexibility now uh, so uh, here trading the t20 most of you are aware of the t20 setup which, um, where she goes through the sheet April sorry April if you're watching this goes through great detail how to trade the t20 and other setups now we go back uh, what else have I got there uh, okay so there, there's a number of uh, once again there's nine uh, powerpoints in there have a look at that now uh, one of the PowerPoint series from Ali who's been a long-term member Ali put together he calls it the t28 which is my pivot magnet trade so the pivot magnet trade uh, Ali started looking very very closely um, uh, so we thought he'd give it a code so uh, of course most of the things like the t10s t11s t12 t8s uh, so Ali called it the t28 uh, stays at an 85 90% win loss ratio sometime later it gives other feedback where is it here maybe maybe it's some earlier emails there bottom line is um, back tests over 100 look the pivot magnet trade kicks butt and always will kick butt because of the logic we're using pivots we can also use the current days open high low or pro, sorry the prior days open high low and close we can use our major EMAs and of course which we will quickly look at because I've got a couple of new indicators for you um, you can also uh, use the round numbers on CL so Ali will go through how he trades and some great examples and of course we covered this in the monthly coaching classes in great detail because it is a 90% uh, trade set up and you get multiple pot entry potentials each day uh, really on any trendy market your pivot magnet trades work but remember traders the PM trades pivot magnets t28 um, their trend following setups okay so what we're looking for is both as the PowerPoints I'll explain I really want to see both the entry chart and the anchor chart one trending together now the next one here is is Dan uh, so Dan one of our long-term members and let me just find the folder there where is it here my goodness I know what I've done I've moved it up here let me just uh, quickly go here where is it so Dan's uh, trading plan this is something that get, um, I've got Dan's permission uh, to share this is his trading plan on trading our setups and the reason I bring that up traders is what I'm still discovering is traders tell me daily they want to turn professional 
if they don't have a trading plan uh, we've got a fairly new member um, out of um, uh, Hawaii that sent me his uh, trading plan and Tim from Hawaii and uh, he prepared in his first week an incredible trading plan after really um, uh, binge watching a lot of my videos and whatever and straight away I can tell you I can tell by the detail in a trading plan how good a trade is going to be it, just so much detail he put in and it's so important you don't build a building or a house without a plan exactly the same when it comes to trading enjoy that there's some great details in that one running tick sheets uh, tick sheets <laughs> sorry Freudian slip running tick sheet I've already uh, pretty much uh, covered with you maybe we are going to get through this this is good how to overlay a chart time frame so there's a, there's a link in that folder how we do that let me actually just see here uh, let me just quickly go here and just see if I've got the overlay if I got an overlay on this one mightn't have an over no I don't have an overlay on uh, this set of charts but um, it's just going to show on oh, by the way here is a hard chart now this is the hard chart on the YM the two tick so here we just had a 2B up there you had a 2B a 2B uh, and that was probably a 2BD but either way 2B now hard charts are a trading methodology within themselves you may notice we don't use the super scalper on hard charts why because the spinning tops give you all of that same sort of information but that is the hard chart but why me I may as well show you April's charts now April and I are having a bit of a joke in the live room the other night I was saying look but some of these colors are too pretty for me <laughs> okay so April has designed these um, basically to suit her she as I said April no sending me any nasty emails I know you'll watch this video is that um, I said she likes the soft pastel colors so um, April was kind enough to provide a template and so she's trading all of um, my standard setups but simply using and she's made some alter I shouldn't say simply but she's made some alterations to the MACD BB that I have for ninja trader now I've only got the MACD BB indicator that I've got I've only got it for NT8 now most platforms now you can get a, a, a MACD BB however you can still use the long, the anchor chart one long-term stochastic or the 21 EMA to do a very very similar thing come and join the coaching classes and I'll show you how to do it but it's pretty straightforward so that one that's on the Y and now on the NQ uh, the micro NQ I was just getting this ready to, to cover and discuss in tonight's um, or tomorrow morning through my US colleagues our uh, live room okay this one's on the micro NQ okay and so it just shows you a nice crossover here uh, trading in the direction of the higher time frame now whilst we're here I may as well bring this up as well so most of you know I love a Texas tea trading oil now oils back to its good old days and so we just had a slingshot just there now what I've uploaded into the NT8 folder and I only have it for NT8 and I'll if you don't have NT8 I'll just all I would do if I until I got this indicator a month ago okay um, which any member can gain access to it, but only works on NT8 what I would do is I would drop in a vertical line on our sorry a horizontal line on our round numbers okay so uh, at uh, 20 cents 50 cents 80 cents uh, and the other round numbers I'd drop in and just leave the line there okay now what I've got though is an indicator that will plot automatically so we can see we're bouncing straight off the 20 cent level look at this bouncing off a, whoops that's probably the same area okay look at that there you're up at the 50 cent uh, you're back up there at 50 um, nothing there look up there at uh, 68 a barrel look at this here you're back down here to uh, 80 cents and so the round numbers kick butt now and once again you can trade these uh, using pivot magnets so you can see 
just there you had a pivot magnet trade and just there now don't forget though we also have our standard uh, floor pivots and our open high low and close indicators okay which is hard for you to see there it's right at the round numbers so the round it's called the round number okay indicator you'll find it in the NT8 indicator folder now also in that folder I hope I didn't close it down no I didn't okay uh, if you trade with NT8 go to the NT8 folder you'll see there we've got literally dozens of indicators so members provide now some of these indicators I haven't verified or loaded because I won't use them but some other members swear by but if you want to stick initially stick very closely to what I do okay once you master those you can always look at other ways of perhaps improving or looking at other things you might do but if you're after my templates if you go into raise charts see where it says chart templates so I've got uh, a number of videos on how to set up the indicators and also um, uh, there's a whole lot of cheat sheets of course on how to set up indicators if you don't have NT8 but in here you'll see in the folder latest templates okay I now date the templates all right so I've got some there with uh, some some there for anchor charts uh, some there just for a standard entry chart so you can download those uh, yourself directly okay out of the NT8 uh, folder so oh templates the six of a six so that's really recent here uh, and that was on there's an entry chart the anchor chart 2 and the anchor chart 1 so if you want to model my charts exactly if you've got NT8 you can then uh, do that okay now just on the charts that I was showing you is now if we go to the June this year folder okay so if we go into June you'll see there that um, here charts for members so if you're a brand new member this is where you get your coaching handouts each month now the Sunday before I upload all of the handouts that we actually refer to in the set we never get to them all don't worry never get to them all but um, here I upload the new charts there each week or you'll find that I'm going to be opening a folder um, uh, on my Google Drive a general Google Drive called charts for members as well okay so you'll be able to go in there and study a whole lot of uh, charts and that brings me up with another uh, indicator I wanted to uh, bring up and mention to you uh, let's get back to my PowerPoint here let's just check out what's happening by the way it's a t20-1 and a slingshot I just mentioned and on the YM how's that going okay plotting along now of course I'm recording this by the way at 9 15 central standard time so we're in what we call the Globex session so we get some fantastic trading uh, during the Globex session so don't be deceived by after hours there's some yeah, it's a lot slower and a lot more tradable usually now what was I going to show you ah I know another great little indicator I've got here uh, you know, I've already mentioned the round number and here it is here once again we're just bouncing off so this is actually in the chart folder indicator but I've also got one here uh, here on trading measured moves now this indicator is actually based upon and I might actually illustrate it to you live on the charts here in a moment it's illustrated uh, on uh, it's basically exactly the same indicator of a gentleman who wrote the book trading the measured move now the measured move that uh, in the book that uh, the gentleman mentions is quite different to say how many traders would look for an example we would look at uh, take that uh, point A to point B and we'd put that from C to D okay so many will call that a measured move okay so do that manually but there's this indicator uh, measured move indicator that is in my Google Drive in the NT8 folder now I'll quickly show you if you don't have uh, NT8 and you can't use this indicator I'll, I'll show you what else you can do uh, to do it now if we look at this uh, let me just look at this one here so if I go and apply the measured move uh, say from there to there 
let's just say I've got entry there okay so what I can see here is that uh, we've we've had a retracement back to the 78.6% uh, we've uh, hit the the uh, hundred percent our first targets at minus 27 there's our second target okay up there and we hit that so this is this little measured move indicator let me just try to find you another spot where I can use it as an example all right let's let's uh, why don't we just do this one okay so let me just go from there to there and perhaps to there's my entry so we can see there that uh, right on you had a had an exact 61% retracement now the 61.8% is meant to be the sort of the make or break level so you can see we rally back we hit the 61.8 and for 61.8 down here is the ultimate target down here that's sort of your ultimate target and you can see we actually uh, hit that now what if you don't have NT8 for this indicator well that's where you can then go and apply if you want your standard uh, fib indicator okay just your fam standard fib retracement so if you go and look uh, just there you can see here I've got a 61% uh, retracement there a little bit further and then I can go and apply a fib extension indicator from there to there right on that point there that little peak and it tells me the exact same thing okay so you can use if you want to really look for those fib retracements uh, and the ideal sort of scenarios and and I don't look the book gives some great advice but there's so many variables but you know really the 50 to 61 percent is meant to be sort of the the ideal retracement bounce area but that can vary depending on a number of other things which I won't get into now the bottom line is you can apply a fib extension which will give you something very very similar so the measured move indicator you will find uh, uh, in the NT8 folder under measured moves so I think you'll find I'll just leave that there for now so I think you'll uh, find that very interesting if you've got the time to uh, run through with the charts okay um, what else we got here for t78 now for t78 let's go back to the charts here is something get uh, we refer to I refer to regularly and some of their members love for t78 or the t88 and it's a concept I picked up from Jake Bernstein uh, where he'll use an 8 by 8 now I've got a video link in that folder so in that folder with all those resources um, you'll find there a video link to how to set up and how to trade the t78 uh, and the reason I uh, it's a t78 or a t88 is that uh, he recommends an 8 by 8 on a time-based chart a standard chart I've found that on Renko a t88 and I won't get into how you set it up you can read all of that and see that in the video but um, I find that the t78 works best on the anchor charts all right so what I'm looking at doing is trading in the direction uh, let me just give you an example here all right so on the right there we can see that I've got the t78 channel so I'm looking for basically long trades in the direction of that channel until we get a crossover it's a great trend directional indicator now uh, the instructions how to set that up on any platform is in the PowerPoint and the video now one thing I just want to emphasize when Jake put this together the concept was was to keep you in for the runners okay that's what it was really there for is to keep you in uh, for the runners back to our PowerPoint here round number indicator the MACD now the MACD indicator that I've got uh, very important when you log into the members area and you download the indicator please read the instruction on the zip folder okay because what you'll actually see it says to let me just quickly get here get out of that templates race charts to see if I've got 
example here is that when you download the zip folder uh, might be in the main area and so you can see here I've got a lot of instructions on it but uh, nt8 that's sorry I'm just going to get into that and see if I can find it for you see if it's in this one MACDBB. yes here it is here so when you download it you've got to open the zip folder for it to open it for NT8 okay so right click on it first and open the folder otherwise it will come up that it's not current version so there's the zip folder oh, sorry the indicator is inside the five the, the folder itself okay hopefully that comes out right so it's inside there so um, just spend some time so if you've got any any issues with it drop me a line but you've got to open the zip folder for it all right looks like we are going to get through everything um, here uh, race templates now trading divergence now when it comes to trading divergence so uh, getting back there's so many variables of course trading divergence so what I've opened up with and there's lots of different types of divergence trading measured moves I think that book is probably an ebook copy in there is trading measured moves and so a lot of information there on even I've even created PowerPoints there on trading measured moves so make sure you have a look at that but back to the members area and divergence so if I get down here to divergence where's the D is DIV where is it divergence trading what I've uploaded into the members area is a whole range of what I classify as good articles great screenshots my own PowerPoints very very extensive on trading divergence okay so I've also got well for example this PowerPoint which we go through extensively um, uh, in, in coaching sessions particularly on how to trade divergence but just remember there is also a folder in the general members area called strategy powerpoints where you'll find a stack of powerpoints there also on divergence trading etc etc okay and we cover these also in the coaching session but there is a folder now that's only recent addition uh, called divergence trading in and on the Google Drive um, now the last one so this is good uh, trial trip this is it good I've covered it <laughs> okay just about uh, covered it. so let me just start uh, pull something up here and we've got MacB oh I've also uploaded another folder and I no longer update it but as far as you know, motivational quotes and things like that so um, as you know you hear me talk about the hour of power getting into a peak mental state each and every day so some some really motivation motivating quotes I've put together here in a PowerPoint formation that you can download and do whatever you wish with okay uh, I love this one okay, I love Jack okay so um, but most of them here are very motivational and success orientated let's tame the beast who's the beast you're the beast you've got to tame your emotions when it comes to trading so that is also being uploaded now uh, now just as a quick reminder here whoops back to this just very quickly if you're not currently a member okay so this is going out to all members but if you're not a member hundred and ninety seven dollars you can attend uh, you can attend eight of my live coaching sessions pause the video and you can read what you get here uh, you'll find a link to join down below now uh, if you also want to obtain my complete program and one year's membership to my coaching sessions I do eight of those a month two hour sessions are recorded and I do 12 live trading room sessions you can save over four thousand dollars compared to my website price and so um, 497 dollars you'll save that so literally about 10 percent of the cost you get all of my indicators you get the works you can have a read of that pause the video now if you're currently a member which most of you would be watching this uh, here you can join uh, and so if you haven't been in there for a while or maybe you've been sitting on the fence or maybe you own just own the day traders fast track program for $397 you can join uh, 
the coaching sessions so there's two a week and there's three live trading room sessions so you can click on the link below if you're watching this on YouTube which you will be all of the details um, are there so basically it's 144 live trading sessions and 96 um, uh, coach two hour coaching sessions and we typically as most of you now have close to 200 in each session so come and join uh, our coaching session so traders that's the summary so I'm going to be doing this regularly now so just check the date so every time I do an update and I've already got some new things from of just coming from members for an example like uh, the v VWAP uh, I'm not in the trading of VWAP but uh, we've got a, a new member who sent me through a great indicator and some other information and a whole lot of other goodies have come through so uh, traders um, uh, I hope this is of benefit and as always traders I love day trading hope to see you in my classes cheers everyone